Are you... Are you someone... Maybe... Who knew Haley? Maybe someone... Did you know her when you were alive? Or are you just maybe... The evil spirit? Maybe... Or maybe just a... Scared coward is gonna come out and... Try what you're doing to her on me. Come on. I'm just sitting here. Give me something. Just a little something. Come on. You're not gonna come out. Nah, there's no way you're coming out. Uh uh. Got a grown person here. Now, I have a scary little girl, so that's all you like to mess with. Yeah. Yeah, you're not coming out. There's no way. You're just too scared. Sit over there, see if we got anything. Pick up our toys. To see such a little girl going through something like this, no one should ever be afraid of their own room. So far, it's been, a, it's been a pretty long night. Been through just about every inch of this, this house. Other than the experience that I had with the flashlight. Nothing else. So as I've said before, hopefully, the evidence would have caught something. Go ahead and pick up the digital recorder. This is Kelly Weaver of Tops. Ending EVP session. Hopefully we got something and hopefully we can set this girl's mind at ease. just heard what it sounded like. Door closing. Thanks for having us out. Went through all the house, uh, got a lot of shots, um, got a lot of pictures, got a lot of EVP scores, so hopefully we find something and we'll let you know. I do believe that the case went pretty well. Both of our investigators in training did a pretty good job. Uh, Natalie especially did a pretty good job for her first case. And Maggie was definitely picking up um, all the training of being a ghost hunter pretty well. So 
now I have a lot of evidence to go over, um, a lot of EVPs, a lot of video, a lot of pictures, and hopefully we can find answers to what lies in the dark. It was a pretty long night at the McMichael house. Now it's time for me to go over all the pictures that we got, all the EVPs that we've recorded, and all the videos that we shot, and see if we found any answers to what lies in the dark. This part of the show is called the EVP session. This is where we let you listen to all the EVPs that we've gotten from an investigation. And we got a couple of pretty good ones, so hopefully you guys will enjoy. Don't be scared. Just let you know we're not leaving for a while, so uh let us know that you're in here with us so that we can stop wasting our time in here if you're not. Do you have blonde hair? Is there a reason why you're haunting this little girl? Why you're scaring her? I just want something like it. I'm going to place the digital recorder onto the table, and if you'd like to give me a sign or tell me your name, you can speak right into the digital recorder. After going through all the evidence, the video, the EVPs, and the pictures that we got, I can clearly say that this place, I can't say that it's haunted, but I can't say that there's something there. The Orlando Paranormal Society will be looking forward to investigating the McMichael House again. Paranormal Society would like to thank the McMichael family for inviting us out to their house. If you've experienced anything in the paranormal or would like to get more information on the Orlando Paranormal Society, check us out at myspace.com slash Orlando Paranormal or if you'd like to watch more of our videos, check us out at youtube.com slash Kelly. Thank you for watching tonight's episode. And as a close friend of mine would say, stay spooky. See you next time on To What Lies in the Dark. Mm -hmm.